A second-hand bookstore in Shinju is about to shut down after 45 years in business. Book lovers in Shinju have been taking refuge in Seaside Books since 1978. It was founded by a post-war Chinese immigrant who then passed it on to his dear friend. Now owner Huang Shouyu is finally ready to call it quits. The locals are now rushing to spend a few more precious moments in their beloved store and pick up a bargain at the same time. With the rise of online retail, brick-and-mortar bookstores like this one are a vanishing breed. This eye-catching blue sign reading Seaside Books has hung here for 45 years. But now, the owner is preparing to close the shutters for the last time. There aren't many stores like this. These days, people don't look books that much, nor do they value them. So I think it's really a pity for a store with as much warmth as this to close down. Back in the days when we weren't so affluent, sometimes students actually couldn't afford books. Seaside Books offered relatively low prices. I bought lots of novels from here. Then I married and had children, and when my daughter was small, we often came here to buy children's books. Located near Shinju train station, Seaside Books is the oldest second-hand bookstore in Shinju. It has been a stable fixture and a comforting sanctuary over the decades for countless local book lovers. It's a really tough decision for me. I took the store on 18 years ago. I've been wanting to close down for about a year now. Store owner Huang Shouyu has kept the business going for many years in memory of a beloved friend. 45 years ago, Chinese Nationalist Army veteran Chen Yao rented the store and opened Seaside Books, naming the store to reflect his love for his homeland across the Taiwan Strait. Over 27 years, he and his landlady Huang Shouyu became as close as family. Before his death, he handed the store over to her. Some of the books are still in great condition. At the very end, I will send them off more cheaply. Huang has reluctantly placed all her stocks out for sale with discounts for a final clearance. She plans to close for the last time within a month or two. In the meantime, she hopes to give the store a send-off fit for a local treasure.